The tripartite talks involving the Government of India, the Government of Manipur and the United Naga Council, UNC, concluded today at the DC Conference Hall Mini Secretariat Complex in Sanapati District. Discussions revolved around the contentious creation of seven new districts in Manipur by the then Congress-led government in December 2016, which the UNC has consistently demanded be rolled back. Despite the UNC's insistence, the Manipur government cited challenges in presenting a concrete proposal during this round of talks. This elicited strong objections from the UNC, which emphasized the urgency of a substantive proposal in the next meeting. Both parties, however, reaffirmed their commitment to continuing the dialogue in a sustained and time-bound manner with the aim of achieving a political resolution. The next round of talks is scheduled for the last week of January 2025 to be held again in Senapati. The discussions which resumed after a five-year hiatus earlier this October in New Delhi mark a renewed effort to address a dispute that has strained relations between the state government and the Naga community. Key representatives in the meeting included A.K. Mishra, advisor for Northeast Affairs, representing the Government of India, and N. Ashok Kumar, Commissioner Home for the Government of Manipur. The UNC delegation was led by N.G. Lorho, President UNC, alongside other prominent leaders like Vareyo Shatsang, General Secretary UNC, Priscilla Tiumai, President NWU, and Lui Kang Luxon, President Ansam. The talks were held in a cordial atmosphere with all parties agreeing on the necessity of resolving the issue politically. The UNC's demand for rolling back the seven districts remains central to the discussions, reflecting the deep-rooted concerns over administrative reorganization in the state. As stakeholders await the next round of negotiations, the outcome will significantly shape the region's political and social landscape.